How's it going everybody? Uh, in my last video I told you I bought some uh, Speedmaster head studs, studs and main studs and uh, it was a mistake and I needed to buy some ARP which they came in. Well, I think I figured it out and here's what's going on. I'm going to show you. Here they are lined up. You can see the difference but what it is is if you, and I have the chamfers, uh, the chamfers lined up there. See how short? The Speedmasters are ARP is longer, and I'm going to show you here on the engine just to uh, prove this to you guys. This is a Speedmaster. Take it over here. There's one installed. See how short it is. Take it over here. Stick it in there. Hand tighten it down. Got a little quick speed wrench here to make it quicker. Um, I'm obviously doing with this with one hand, so it's not like it's going to be over tightened. There it is. That's bottomed out, hand tight, like spec. That's it. Can't even get a washer on it. And, like I stated before, actually, you know what? I'm going to leave that on and take it off with the speed wrench. Like I stated in my last video, this head does not even have a head gasket on it. I was uh, doing some work to verify piston the valve clearance, which I like to do without a head gasket on. This is kind of difficult here with uh, one hand, but I want to be able to visually show you the difference afterwards. So that's it out. So there's the Speedmaster. Now we'll take one of the ARPs and do the same thing. And run it in one handed. Nothing funky, nothing tricky. Not endorsed by ARP by any means. There we go. Finger tight washer and nut you can physically see how high that sits sorry for that on the camera again one of these days I'll get another camera instead of using my phone which will make this a lot nicer there we go finger tight look at the difference that's with a washer and a nut. So again, pull it out of here, keeping them both on. There's a the difference. If I can line these up relatively close. But there's the difference. That's a huge difference, guys. Especially on a head gasket, running boost. Speedmaster, sorry, you guys dropped the ball. Pro Comp, I think that's who makes them, like I stated before. I would never run those products ever again, and I wouldn't trust them. Like I said, I bought new main studs, too. They're, that's getting taken out, so tried to cheap out, and uh, I ended up spending double. Well, not double, but almost double. So, so everybody knows it wasn't, uh, I didn't just, you know, grab different ones out of here. Here, I'll grab, hell, I'll grab one out of the bag over. I'll grab, grab this one right here. We'll do this again. Stick it in there. Spin her down. They're all the same, guys. It's, I mean, well, you can see, look at it. They're all the same. The end ones are okay. Um, but there we go. Let's add in there. I don't even grab a washer because, oh, you know what? Better yet, let me grab one of their washers that they stuck in this bag and stick it on. I guess I should have done that to show you what we would have gotten. There we go. Doesn't even come through. To me, that is not a good fastener. That is not a good clamp. 
Um, spin this out real quickly here. There you go, that's what you get if you actually put a washer on it. it. Doesn't even come close to coming through the head of the bolt. Just junk. Here's the bottom ones. You can see that one sits a little bit higher. I'll take this. And I'll take this. So it's not just it's not just the long ones, guys. It's all of them. Everything that came in the kit. There's a massive difference. And for some reason on this one, I don't know why, but it binds a little bit. Sorry about the big ass wrench, but that's what I had sitting around. So there's the difference here. I mean. That you could probably get a washer on it and uh, it would be flush maybe. That has a washer on it. I mean, so there you go. ARP versus Speedmaster. Speedmaster junk. ARP wins again. Pay for it once, not twice, guys, like I did. Um, again, nothing against them. I figured I'd try them, but I don't trust them. They ain't going in my build. Thanks for watching.